Hey everybody, this is Dick Justice doing a video review for Transformers Battle Blades Optimus Prime. Uh, this is the Battle Hooks version from Dark of the Moon with all the stars and the lunar moon stuff going on with it. Uh, but it's the Voyager complicated Optimus Prime that looks like the leader. Size, here he is with uh, Orion Pax from Generations. They're both, you know, kind of compact trucks. And there he is with Pokey. So, I mean, I I think he's okay sized for being a Voyager. <coughs> um, not super great, but whatever. The wheels roll, that's about it. So, to transform this guy, you want to take the guns off. They pull down, and they fill in down here. I don't think they're prone to breaking off these tabs, but anytime I see tabs like this, I like to exercise caution. So, we'll just put those off to the side and come back to them later. Um, next, you want to... Uh, these sides on the sleeper portion of the cab pull off. Uh, they do something. This guy is... Uh, when I found him, he was in the middle of transformation, kind of all sprawled out. So you want to take these wheel covers. And they pull up and then around to the back. Um, what happened was I bought a six-year-old's collection on Craigslist. His mom was selling it. I don't know why. I didn't ask. And um, this guy was all sprawled out in the middle of transformation, and it took me the better part of half an hour to figure out how to get it back. And that's coming from somebody that did have this mold before. So I'm, uh, you know, just, the first thing you want to do is just kind of take him apart and unpeg everything, and then. At least from what I found, it's a little bit more intuitive as to how everything goes back together once everything is apart. So, like the lower torso is, or the lower body rather is very easy. You just have legs. This is about where he was when I got him, by the way. Just kind of all. Uh, um, I mean, it just col the legs just collapse up. Um, these. Wheels are tabbed in, they just kind of go off to the side. But then the legs just collapse. You want to rotate the wheels, these wheel wells anyway, so that he can get his ankle articulation. These blue panels flip forward, and you want to flip his toes down. But that's, that's the extent of the legs. It's really not that complicated once you get him apart. You just got to get him. part now uh, you want to split that and his head comes out and I'm going to try my hardest to keep as much of this on camera as possible and I'm very sorry if anybody wants to go back to truck mode, because that's not going to happen. I got this guy into truck mode and then waited to do the re video review. Um, all of this collapses to form his uh, midsection. There's a, there's a tab here that goes in on to the back of the truck. And all of that tabs pretty securely. Um... Where do we go from here? We want to get the arms off to the side so that we can... So, somebody didn't fold here. Oh, here it is. Uh, there's this, there's a hinge down here. And that all folds up and that only sounded nasty. So these side panels that we got out of the way first uh, rotate kind of down and then they peg in 
and uh, this thing rotates and pegs so the backpack actually does peg together kind of nicely it's not quite going on for there we go so it looks like that um, next there's the side windows in here they come out to the front I'm going to lift the sun visor thing out of the way too and then um, they just kind of fold down and peg onto the red piece I think yeah, it looks like they should Yes, they do. Right onto that red piece. Um, folding things up, folding things around, orienting things. Why didn't that peg in correctly? There we go. Did I miss something? I think I might have missed something. Or something might be missing. Oh no, here it is. Uh, underneath the head, there's a piece that comes out and fills in the chest. It interlocks with that red piece. And, uh, at which point, then, you can begin to straighten his arms out. You kind of got to get the hooks out of the way to do that. And inside the forearm is the fist. So uh, this guy is kind of like all the grief of the leader version, but it's smaller. So I think we're there at this point. Yeah, it looks like we're about there. Just get everything a little bit straightened out. Uh, he stands really well. Um, and he, he is pretty detailed. Coming back to the guns here. You just unfold the barrel, unfold that barrel, and he can hold his guns, you know, whatever. Uh, he's got hooks. So this is the battle hooks version. I think this, the, the battle hooks mold was the Japanese release. Um, here he is with his lunar buggy companion that was in the two pack with him. So a little bit taller. A little bit larger. That's expected. Difference between a Voyager and a Deluxe. Um, very complicated figure. Like this one is probably never going to see truck mode again as long as I own it. Uh, it's got one, a neat gimmick with the Matrix that I didn't show off. You uh, unpeg all of the chest stuff. And then... Uh, of course the Matrix on mine falls off. Um, if you pull the red piece down, the, this blue panel with the matrix flips up, and for some reason this matrix isn't pegging on very well. But there's a, there's a matrix in there. And it just flew out when I tried to put it back, so... But it, it is the correct matrix, and I, I don't know why it won't stay, but um, you can close them back up then. And uh, that's the Battle Hooks version of Battle Blades Prime.